What have you done? What's going on YouTube? I know it's been a bit since I've done something and you requested this. So today I'm going to be doing a quick little video on my brother's 79F150. It's a monster. Hope you, I think you'll enjoy this. Alright, so here it is. It is a 79F150 Ford pickup. This thing when he got it was sitting on 44s. I think he said it was an ex-show truck back in the day. I think maybe late 80s, early 90s is what it was. But now, this Hoss Cat is sitting on 49 inch military sand trail tires. These are straight mil spec. He got them off a of military surplus site. All four are. These are 20 by 14 moto metal wheels. So that should give you some aspect. Those are 20s on those tires. <laughs> They're ridiculous. They're ginormous! The engine up under this sucker is a 351 modified, and it is mated to a T18 four-speed manual. Now this truck, when he got it, was an automatic, so he had to swap it to the manual himself. So he did the manual swap and everything. He did the old-fashioned, like, uh, what is it? Barber-style corkscrew on there. He's got these, he's got duals, both side pipes running straight off. It sounds amazing. Now, the reason that I can tell you this is a show truck, and it's 28 inches of lift, remember that. <laughs> is look at these leaf springs. Look at those suckers, and yes, quad shock. Quad shock, these leaf springs are pretty much a U. They're a ridiculously insane now one other little party piece is you can see it right here these are dual horn blaster outlaw air horns and this they're triples if you can see over there see they're dual triples this thing sounds literally like a train coming down the tracks hitting its horn yelling at you ah it's really painful it's an absolute animal it's got dana 44 and dana 60 axles yes he's running the bluetooth special on the front right now but he hasn't had the chance to hook that up quad stabilizers on the front i mean look look at the size of the tires he's running here dude it's insanity of course it's going to be what it is now the patina on it he uses some sort of special paint i forget exactly what but he did the black trim. It was chrome trim at first, but he did the black on it. Did the headlights. He had to do a good chunk of work to this old girl when he got it. Now, she does run and drive. I can't fire it up for you right now, right off the rip. I don't have his keys. But in order to make this thing move, the back axle, and I think the front too, that it has 558 gears in the sucker to make this big old monster mesh above the law monster actually propel itself down the road i mean it's the thing's an absolute animal and he did a whole bunch of small stuff that you wouldn't realize like in the bed here he's got his air tank for his air horns he's got some bracing in the back to help brace the bed itself so that way when you're going down the road the bed doesn't get all floppy and crazy yes it's still the split window in the back and on the inside, we've got fully custom mounted NRG racing bucket seats. Got his four speed shifter there, nice classical wood steering wheel. And again, this thing is functional. It will go down the road. It is tag title and insured. It's an 
animal. It's, I mean, it is. It's just, it's a crazy thing. Now, I'm 5'9". Remember that, all right? I'm 5'9". And that's the bed top, right? Here I am standing full up next to this sucker. Look, I'm 5'9". See the door handle here? Look at that. It's ridiculous. I think we measured the roof to be about... Oh, what was it? I'm 5'9", come to the roof. I think we measured the roof to be at about... Oh, eight and a half, almost nine foot for the roof height. Wow. To give you that idea. And it is power steering, I believe. And I think he took the steering... I think the steering box is off of a dump truck. If I remember right for this thing. Again, it's just an animal. See these nice big long tube headers coming off of this 351 modified. And see, this is what I meant by true duels both sides. Yeah, that's how he would get in is hike your leg all the way up onto this chain. It's just ridiculous. Here's a better shot of that steering wheel. You gotta have the correct turn-ons. He had to do the pedals himself because it was an automatic truck keys are in it that's tempting but i don't know how to start this thing he's got a it's like biff's car off of back to the future you gotta know the truck to fire this sucker up it's just it's absolute insanity a few times we've taken it to shows it's gotten plenty of looks plenty of eye candy for everybody and the one thing that usually happens is there's at least one or two people that come up and they're like hey can i try and get in it because it's it's a spectacle. Again, I'm 5'9", and the floor to this thing, the floor to this thing, I'm 5'9". It comes to my, right under my chest, almost to my nipple. That's how tall this is. And this here, I like this view better. Yeah, I'm 5'9". I'm still under the door handle for this thing. The headlights on the sucker are literally at my head gives you an idea when I say it's a monster it's a monster and a half well there's something you don't see every day a few times I've rode in this it's literally like you're riding in a building it's crazy now I know I took a while to make this video I'm sorry guys and I'll do better at getting more content to you life got crazy they updated my work at work so I'm doing more I'm getting off later I'm Starting to make moves on a house that I'm renovating and physical work with my bike because it's on it's in the shop right now. I do some work on the crank and it'll hopefully be running in the next I'd say for safe to say couple weeks if I can actually work on it each day after work. Just gotta see. But we are working on it. I'll throw in some bonuses. This is my little car, it's a 92 Volkswagen Fox. If you want to know more about it. And see under the hood and some in-depth stuff of some stuff that you wouldn't know about this car show me in the comments other one is my dad's 92 Ford Ranger I think it's a 92 94 maybe can't remember for sure it may look stock but trust me it isn't it's got a surprise for you that you wouldn't expect again if you want to know about this monster let me know in the comments you got my brother's Audi over here as well it's beautiful if you want to see a video of that again likes and comments for all of these this is my dad's mini now this one i won't do a video on because everybody knows a mini clubman but this little dude's got a little party piece that you wouldn't notice if you didn't pay attention but ow, ow, there's some thorns here looky here yes this is a turbo car it is a clubman s cooper works is what this is this has a turbocharged four cylinder on it and this thing's pushing about 300 plus horse this little tiny car is a rocket ship this under the tarp with these massive meats is my dad's mustang that is the one that i said i'll do another video on and you will get a video of that it's been, it's, it's gnarly so again whatever ones you want to see some more of Drop them down in the comments. 
whatever comment is most liked or most commented about I'll do another video of I'm just trying to give you guys some more some more stuff see funny stickers on the car some more funny stuff to do so yeah I'll get I'll get working on some more content y'all just comment what car you want to see next I'll get to work on it as best I can while I'm trying to shuffle and do what I do with my everyday job I'll be working on more content Remember to like, subscribe. I'll catch y'all on the next one.